Hey everyone, excited to be back for this week's edition of Frequently Asked Questions for Commercial Real Estate. In today's video, what I want to do is talk about a question that I often get asked by people who are looking to lease commercial property, and that is, how do I calculate commercial rent when you're looking at triple net lease opportunities? This is extremely pertinent, in particular those who are looking to lease retail and industrial space. So this, if this applies to you, it's worth sticking around. So if, before we do that, I would really appreciate if you could like and subscribe to this channel. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm and ensures more and more people can hear this message. So now that you've done that, go ahead and click below. Let's go ahead and dive right into this episode. So when you're looking to calculate commercial rent, when you're looking at triple net leases, there's two things you have to consider. The first is the base rent. And this is a number that's usually advertised on the listing as base rent from a commercial real estate agent. Uh, these are typically quoted on a price per square foot basis and will be multiplied by the area of the property that you're going to be occupying and then divided by 12. So as an example, let's say you're looking at a 2,000 square foot space and the base rent advertised is $12 a square foot. You would take your 2,000 2, square feet of space, multiply it by $12 a square foot to get $24,000 in yearly base rent. You would then divide it by 12 and you would get your $2,000 a month in base rent. Now, that's not the end of the calculation. Now, you got to consider the triple net expenses. Uh, there's various ways to that, that they're advertised. Sometimes they're advertised as triple net expenses or triple net charges. Sometimes even uh, they'll advertise it as CAM charges, even though they're not technically CAM charges, but some brokers kind of lump it together into that expense as well. So when you see that that being advertised, you need to take this next step which is to take the price per square foot for those cam char or those net charges and then multiply it by the square footage of that space to get your net charges. So in this same example that you had before, you're going to have 2,000 square feet times your triple net charges. And let's say in this example, the triple net charges is $3 a square foot. You would take your $2,000 or 2,000 square feet, multiply it by your $3 per square foot to get $6,000 per year in triple net charges. Once you divide that by 12, you get your $500 a month in net charges. And these net charges, as we've talked about in various videos related to triple net leases, include your property taxes, insurance, and general maintenance on the property. So in order to calculate your total monthly cash outflow for that particular building, you would take your 2,000 square feet in base or $2,000 uh, per month in base rent and add that to your net charges of $500 per month and you get your $2,500 in monthly cash outflow as it pertains to that triple net lease. Now, triple net charges are usually collected by landlords on a quarterly, biannually, or annual basis. Uh, so that's something you probably also wanna ask uh, the, the landlord or the, the broker that's involved in that particular transaction to see how that's gonna be collected over time so you can plan that throughout the year uh, to make sure that you're, you have the proper cash flow in order to account for those expenses. So I hope you gain some value from this video. If you really do like this channel, Again, feel free to like and subscribe. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm and ensures more and more people can hear this message. Along with that, if you're in the Louisville metro area and you're looking to lease commercial property and you'd like to help have someone help you with, through that process, I'm a commercial real estate agent here in town. I'd love to be able to help you find the perfect space for your business. You can reach out to me via my email at rafael at grisantigroup.com or you can give me a call or text at 502-536-7315. Again, thank you so much for your time and we'll see you all next time.